Hello and welcome to the Retro Bunker channel. Today we're going to talk about uh, the tape card that's uh, on the 64 Commodore, uh, made by PCB Way. Looks like this. Very handy. You can use a little bit of a SD card and connect it on the back. You can take it out very simply and put it in. And you can copy the files from the computer. Uh, to the tape card and then you plug it in the C64. Let's go look on it. Now we got the C64 on the bench and uh, just look, uh, here we got the tape cassette and we got the tape card, SD card, you put it, put it in here, like that, put it down, connect the video, connect the power and the joystick. And turn it on. You can see a little bit of flashing down there the card and uh, to run it you shift run stop and when you have pressed the run stop it begins to load loading the browser PRG And there we got the list. Then you can choose the program you want to take. And uh, we take uh, Park Patrol, press return. Sorry about the moiré on the screen, uh, but here we got it, the game. It was a very long time I played this one. Oh no! Another famous game that's uh, made to the heart. As you see, it's a very short video. It's my first now on YouTube, and I wish every new member welcome. And uh, uh, it's a very nifty thing with this uh, tape card you can use to access all the files and programs you have. You can even write and own uh, your own programs and transfer them. And now we're gonna show you how you transfer the ROMs over 
to the SD card. This is how you do it. Uh, you take out the tape card SD card, like pushing on it, and it pops out. You take the SD card and put it in the card reader. And now it will pop up on the window. Uh, in the main folder there will be all your games or programs you will put in there. Uh, the D64 map is do not touch that or move it or uh, put D64 programs here because this, this is only for the tape card. Very simple. You can take and file, drag it out, and it's out. And you take, can take an old file or a new game. Just put it, will replace the old one, and it's there on the file. So, very simple way to copy files to the SD card. And that's all for the Retro Bunker. Thank you for this time. Uh, we'll see you in the next episode. Have a nice day. Bye bye.